Good evening, ladies. Hope you're comfortable because this video is about to be really long. So it's 9.50 and I just got to my house. As in, I've been gone since 11.30 this morning um, because I went to work and then I went to church and then I saw um, some like old friends, also my friend's parents, same thing. Like they're we're friends and they're my friend's parents and yeah anyway so I saw them and I was with my aunt and then we all went out to dinner and it was actually really really good because we talked about finding me a new place to live and a new job and all that stuff and that was really good because it was really things that I've been concerned about and whatever and they're awesome Jill your parents are awesome Leslie your mom is awesome that's who I was with. Anyway, besides all that, I made this huge list of things already to talk about. So I'm going to talk about them really quickly because um, it's a lot to talk about and I still need to do homework. Okay, so things I saw today. Um, a child whose last name was um, Enlo. Uh, I think most of you understand that. This is only sort of creepy because I'm actually friends with him on Facebook, so I hope he doesn't see this, but he's really cute. Okay, um, and I saw a homeless man whose pants were very short. Oh my goodness, it was kind of disgusting, actually, and I was talking to Michelle this morning about how I, I see a lot of homeless people now, and it's really depressing, and we'll talk about that another day. Um, and then there was a woman from Chicago. She lives in Lake Forest, but she lived in Oak Park, too. She wasn't very nice, though. And then I saw a beautiful English woman. Oh my goodness, she was beautiful. And then I was like, do you need any help? And she was like, oh, I'm British. And But she sounded way cooler than that. Um, and then I saw, oops, sorry. Then I saw some lost children who thought it would be a really good idea if they went and waited in the parking lot for their parent, for their mom. And we were like, no, don't do that. We'll call her. And they were like, oh, but she left her phone in the car. And we were like, no, we'll call her over the intercom. And then she found them and then she was kind of angry with them. And I kind of felt bad for them because they were getting very upset. Um, then I saw some people who came in with friends and it made me sad because I used to be one of those people. Okay, let's, let's be serious. I have friends, but I really miss you guys and I'm really jealous of Irene and Devin. Yep. Um, and there were lots of smelly people, especially the smelly hippie who was actually pretty cool. Um, and then, oh, the first customers I got this morning were crazy women who were, like, obsessed with the movie Freedom Riders. I, I mean, it was okay movie. I saw it with Michelle, but I wasn't obsessed with it. Um, and then, oh, I wanted to tell you that I'm working really hard on my posture, not that you can tell, because I'm completely slumped over talking to you on the computer. Um, and... I also today I really liked thinking about things I knew wouldn't change, which was actually in reference to Julia working at Cast. I know she won't be very happy about that, but it kind of made me happy thinking that she might be there for a really long time. Um, also, just a word to everyone. Don't go in stores five minutes before they're about to close unless you know exactly what you want. Only if you know exactly what you want, preferably come in 30 minutes before we close. It's really annoying when you're the last person in the store and you don't know what you want. Um, also, I told Michelle this yesterday, but I have decided to continue this vlog until I have a ponytail. Let's look at the ponytail progress. It's pretty decent, but it's kind of like a sprout right now, you know? Not like a real ponytail. I don't know if you could actually see that as my head was faced away from the computer. Um, okay. Question. What is the card game where the discard pile is face up and you can see all of the cards and you can choose whichever card you want, but you have to take all the cards on top of that? I'm tagging you in this video if I think you might know what that card, what that card game is called. I can't remember. But I really liked it. It was very fun. And lastly, so I am short, 5'3 on a good day, mostly 5'2, uh, though at the DMV it said I was 5'3, it was very exciting. Anyway, um, so short people are generally intimidated by tall people. So all you tall people out there, what are you intimidated by? Look how disgusting this is. It's really hurting and it's disgusting.
Yeah, I know you all wanted to see a really close-up shot of my gross, disgusting, temple face. So, sorry about that. But anyway, hope everyone had a great weekend, and I hope everyone has a great week, even though tomorrow is Monday, and I'm going to have a serious case of the Mondays. Nerdbiters. P.S. Michelle and Irene, I really want to talk to you guys both on the phone at the same time sometime soon. We should make that happen. Thanks. P.P.S. So I took Thursdays as my working day because I thought my book club was on Tuesdays and then it turned out that my book club was actually on Thursdays. But then I found out Beth Moore's Bible study starts on Tuesday of this week. How perfect is that? I'm so excited. So Jill's mom and I are going to go and it's going to be awesome because Beth Moore is awesome.